the run is on Sunday and in reality I've only had four weeks proper training which I know is not enough but through all the support and the donations to my Just Giving page I know that I will do it. Eight years ago I suffered a fall at home and had a traumatic brain injury um, which end, I ended up in Leeds General Infirmary in an induced coma for a number of weeks and my family didn't know whether or not I would regain consciousness when they withdrew the drugs and if I did what physical and mental disabilities I could or couldn't have so it was a very uncertain time for everybody. I started running in January this year um, my friend signed me up for the Couch to 5k at the local North Arran Pumas running club um, I'd never run before um, didn't have any inclination to run but when I started it it was really nerve-wracking but and out of my comfort zone but I persevered and at the beginning of March completed the couch to 5k at the Halifax Park run and then lockdown happened and after that I just carried on running and doing bits got my confidence back got my independence it improved my balance significantly because I spent most of my recovery walking with a walking stick um, and the virtual London Marathon came up and even though I haven't had long to train I thought it'd be a really good opportunity for me to raise awareness of people who do have traumatic brain in injuries and the, the problems and support that they need, which is why I'm doing that. I just want to give something back as a thank you to those who saved my life and also those who are still suffering the after effects of having a brain injury. I am wanted to raise funds for Headway, the Brain Injury Association and also for the Neurosurgery Department at Leeds General Infirmary. Right, my name's Darren Renshaw, uh, we're in Barnsley and I'm planning on running the uh, virtual London uh, Marathon a week on Sunday. I mean, I've always wanted to run the London Marathon, always. Um, so a bit of disappointment uh, this year not to be able to be on the starting line in, um, in April and now I'm a bit disappointed not to be on the starting line in October but this is a good, uh, a good uh, sort of follow up to that really. I'm planning on running from the house and I'm going to be running through um, Rotherham uh, Barnsley, Sheffield and these surrounding areas which is quite hilly. Fingers crossed, uh, be just under four hours so about 3.50 I reckon um, but that depends on uh, on the day and the and the hills that are, are there to be taken so uh, but looking forward to it. My nan, um, this is the third time that she's had uh, breast cancer she's managed to overcome it twice um, but this third time um, just can't overcome it now because of her age, she's 94 uh, but my mum's had uh, skin cancer and uh, my sister-in-law's had breast cancer. We've got three strong women there, two that have overcome it which is fantastic. Uh, a really strong character in my nan that's overcome it twice but this last time uh, they can't do a lot for her this time so it's really, really I want to raise as much money as I can to, um, to help support other people out there as well. It's really, really important the, uh, the money that we raise for them so they can help support you know, overcoming cancer and getting rid of it altogether. Uh, they've also been very supportive in terms of the uh, you know, topical COVID times as well, um, helping support um, areas with the scientists there as well, so fantastic organisation.